uh, people often worry about the role of literacy and bilingualism and multilingualism, saying that, you know, what's the point of learning a language which doesn't have literacy? Let's say if you're a speaker of Hmong living in the United States and there is a large Hmong community in Minnesota, um, the Hmongs kind of look down upon their language because they don't see what the use of it is. There is no huge literature. And in English, of course, you've got everything from Shakespeare to Quentin Tarantino, and you want to use all that. But literacy is secondary to language, and there are millions and millions of speakers who speak languages with no literacy or with just the oral tradition, and they still have significant knowledge and significant cognitive advantages. So the presence or absence of literacy in a particular language is not a deciding factor in determining whether or not you want to uh, raise your child bilingual or monolingual.